In this movie, I'm going to talk to you about how to select your song lyrics and book titles, and also how to write the explanation paragraphs that go along with them. Let's start with the song lyrics. Choose a song that suits the person you're dedicating your book to or that for some reason reminds you of that person. Find the lyrics online. You can simply Google the title of the song with the word lyrics after it and they should pop up in multiple places. Now here's an important part. You're going to copy and paste the lyrics into a word processor. This is so you can clean up the page that the lyrics are on. The final page that goes in your dedication book should not have advertisements, URL headers, dates you found the lyrics, anything like that on the page. And of course, head that page with the song title, the artist, and the author of the lyrics, which is not always the same person as the artist, but often is. Once you've got your song lyrics chosen, you're going to write a paragraph explaining your choice. Now when I say a short paragraph, I do not mean two sentences. Even three is pretty wimpy. Include some details. Go with our good standby. After every sentence you write, ask yourself why and see if you could add some more detail and depth to your paragraph. Quote some lyrics if you can, if it makes sense and they have something to do with why you chose the song. It's okay to write your paragraph in first person. In other words, you can say, I chose this song because, or this song is important to me because. And you can address the person you're dedicating your book to in this paragraph in either second or third person. Again, as an example, you might say, I chose this book for you because, that would be second person, or I chose this book for my mom because, that would be third person. Now let's move on to book titles. You're going to need to find five books that in some way suit the person you're dedicating your book to or that you'd recommend to that person to read. You might begin by searching online for books on certain topics. You might look for books in certain genres. Or you might think about books that are meaningful to you and or the person you're dedicating your book to. On one single page, list all five titles along with the author of each book. Don't forget to underline or italicize the titles. And then again, once you've got your titles, you're going to need to explain why you chose them. You're writing a separate paragraph to say why you chose each book. That means you'll need to have a different reason for why you chose each book, and you'll need to know enough about each book in order to write a good-sized paragraph about it. Just like with your song lyrics, it's okay to write in first person, and you can address your person in either second or third person point of view. But do stay consistent throughout all of these paragraphs and also match the way you wrote your song lyrics paragraph. In other words, in your song lyrics paragraph, don't write, I chose this book for you, and then turn around in your book title paragraphs and write, I chose this book for my mom. Stick with one style or the other. After you've got these paragraphs written, you should be all set with these final pieces of your dedication book. Now you're ready to get it cleaned up, final drafts made, bound together, and turned in.